A seemingly peaceful and quiet taxi rank in the heart of Stilfontein, but the taxi industry in the area is described as a war zone. Since January, six taxi operators here have been shot at, leaving three dead and three others injured. Santaco says the root cause of the violence is the mounting frustrations of taxi operators who accuse the government of not doing enough to address their challenges. Three years before uh, the two years, we did not have uh, the killings in terms of us being informed. But recently, since last year, we experienced a challenge where there were operators that will, will be stopped at, at um, hiking spots by operators, sometimes by uh, security people who have been deployed by taxi operators because they will be complaining to say the government is not doing enough in terms of dealing away with illegals. The Provincial Department of Transport admits that there are several challenges. Taxi associations are not governed properly by the leadership. Two, there is a contest uh, of leadership. Uh, three, there is a contest for lucrative routes and the control of taxi, of taxi ranks. Four, there is the use of what we call taxi warlords, where the promotion of individuals who bully around others uh, is now in the rise. Five, there is um, illegal operations in the province that have phenomenally grown uh, over a short period of time. Serious intervention measures have already been put in place. We have been able to resolve uh, out of uh, 22 conflicts that were registered with us, we have been able to resolve uh, 15 of those conflicts uh, where parties uh, have been given determinations uh, to deal with uh, the problems that we have identified that causes the conflict. But there are conflicts that can be resolved around the table. Uh, once a person acts illegally, uh, that matter can be resolved around the table. We need to formulate a strategy, a law enforcement strategy that must deal with that type of a problem. Meanwhile, taxi operators refused to speak on camera, but explained that they are now living in fear. Their plea is for law enforcement officials to intensify measures to end the growing violence in the industry. Selwane Gachau, SBC News, Stolfontein.